David here from uh, Project Auto. Uh, today we're just going to be running through the differences between carbon or color stable window tint versus ceramic window tint. Um, I'll start off with the uh, carbon because uh, that's our kind of entry level fuel. So the carbon or any type of fuel is going to block out 99% UV as a minimum. Um, but with the carbon, um, most people tend to go for it because it's more for the aesthetics, a bit more of a black, darker look. So it will give you some heat reduction and UV protection but not as much as what the ceramic will. Um, so I'll move on to the ceramic now. So the ceramic, the benefits of ceramic is that it has much higher infrared rejection, which increases the total solar energy reduction, um, making it a lot more comfortable inside the cabin. You might notice sometimes with cars that are not tinted and the sun shines through the glass, you get that burning feeling on your skin. Um, ceramic reduces that dramatically. Um, and with the extra protection, it does prevent fading of interiors, um, and also insulates the cabin as well when you have the aircon on or even the heater on in winter. So that's the difference between the two. I have a basically a light transmission meter here which will show the UV and the infrared uh, readings of each fuel. So I'll just quickly do a quick test on that. All right, so I'll measure up the readings on the carbon or color stable film first. So this one is a 45% fuel. So it measures at 99.9% .9 UV reduction. And with the infrared reduction, it's at 23.3, so that's the carbon or color stable. And then now to the ceramic. Ceramic, this one measures at 100% UV reduction and 82% infrared reduction. So that's a massive difference there. And that's what's going to give you that, you know, total solar energy rejection. So that's the main thing you want to look for when you're looking for good quality window tint. Um, especially if you're looking for something that's going to protect the occupants and also, you know, the interior and the, and the vehicle itself. 